so I decided that I decided that I want to take the OSCP in August, late August or early September. Not take it, but sign up for the uh, 90 day course. So that's that. And the reason why is that I really want to start my career in information security. Honestly, I feel like there's only two paths for me at this moment. It's like networking or security. And I want to get into security because I feel like it will be a more sought after position in the future. And I actually enjoy it. Um, so I've been doing a lot of pack box boxes, honestly. And they are not easy. I've been trying to complete all the retired easy boxes first before I move on to the orange boxes. And I really want to go back and do all the uh, easy boxes before I'm going back to the orange boxes because there is so much crap, dude. There is so much crap you have to, to know and you have to think in a certain way. It's like it's like when I first started programming and you were giving a pro you're given a problem and you, you your job is to solve this problem, figure out how to do the problem. Like you want to, I don't know. You want to make it so that when somebody rolls rolls a uh, slot machine at a jackpot, and and it, and it returns true only when it's seven seven seven, it's like it's like a problem like that. But there's more than one way to solve the problem, and your job is to think of all different ways to solve the problem, and you, your mind really thinks differently, trying to figure out how can I use this to get to that. I don't know if that makes sense, but. Your mind has to think differently when we're trying to do these capture the flag machines. You really have to think like a user, but at the same time think like a bad actor, but at the same time think like the person who made the software you're trying to get into. And because of that, I have a lot of difficulty because of my personality. Like when I latch onto something, I'm like, this is the right. This is the absolute right way. There's no, there's no way it can't be this. I'm one of those kind of people, right? Like this is it. There's no way it can't be this way. It has to be this way. People who have um, absolute confidence for no fucking reason whatsoever, when they really shouldn't. I'm one of those kind of guys, right? And that has been so bad for me in terms of uh, hack the box. So, <sighs> damn. So, so it, it's retiring now. So there's a machine on hack the box called Netmon. And one of the things you have to do is go in and look at the logs to see the password for the user accounts that that used to log into the website and so there are three logs right there is there is oak there's oak there's configuration configuration that owed a configuration that owed that BAC and I checked configuration and configuration that owed and because I was like okay I checked two enough there's no way a third way could be there's no way no there's no way a third one could be the uh the one that holds all the confident the uh, information and then so I was stuck on this box for forever and it was an easy box too because I was just too arrogant to check the third box then Ipsec comes out with a video talking about oh yeah it's, it's, it's configuration that that bag and it's like it's like he figures it out in the most the most the easiest way possible it's ls.l LS and you can see how big a um no he hashes it he hashes the files and compares the hash to see if they're actually the same. And they're, not, they're not the same. They're all different. And then he goes in, and then the credentials are, the credentials are there in plain text. In plain text, is right there. It's such a bad man, it's right there. And it's like, come on, Jamal. So that's my biggest takeaway. That and because there's no like formal um, documentation of how I learned from. So I really think the OSTP class will help me get this stuff down pack, help me think differently about problems, make sure I have a CTF mindset, and we'll see. <sighs> My name is Jamal Gardner. I make views about politics, health, and technology. If you like what you're watching, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my website down below in the description. See you folks.